Okay, Jarilan. Sige, pakibasa po. Number one, Jarilan. What is timbre? A, the succession of notes and pictures expressing an idea or thought. Letter A po. Tingnan natin kung letter A. Ayan, letter C ang sagot, Jarel Ann. So, what is tembre? Tembre is the quality or character of a sound. Okay, number two. Sinong pwede magbasa? Number two. Jelaine. How are the instruments of in the string family played? Okay, what is the answer, answer Jelaine? Letter B. Ay, pa. Letter B, tingnan natin. The answer is letter A. By plucking the string. Okay. Okay, next, would like to read number three? Sir. Go, Jerry Land. Which of the following string instrument is known as the heart of the orchestra? Letter B po, violin. Tingnan natin kung letter B. The answer is letter B, very good. Okay, number four. Ako muna, number four. Which of the following describes is cello? A. It is the smallest string, string instrument. It is the biggest and has the lowest pitch in the string family. Let us see. It, it is bigger than a viola but smaller than a double bass. And letter D, it is made up of 47 string. Okay, anong sagot dyan? Letter C po. Tingnan natin kung letter C. Very good, letter C. The last one, number five. Sir. Go, Jeril Ann. What is the smallest string okay, instrument okay. in the orchestra? Letter C okay. po. Tingnan natin kung letter C. The answer is letter C. Very good. Okay. okay next, posin tayo. Okay. Anong nakikita niyo sa picture, children? Mga instruments, Mga instruments po. Okay, pakibasa po. Pakibasa. Um, Look at right. the picture. Look at the picture of each musical instrument and give the name of the instrument on the space provided. Okay, sige, sige nga. Ano, lagyan natin ng pangalan. Ano, anong mga pangalan ng mga yan? Drum. Ano yung number one? Drum. What type of drum? Okay, anybody? O magbigay kayo ng kilala nyo lang dyan. May drum. Okay, some more. Hello? Saya po. Clarice, ang sa anong alin sa anong sabi mo Clarice? Sail xylophone po. Anong number ang xylophone? Sabihin niyo anong number. Number 3. Okay. Christoph. Sir. Yes, Daryl Ann. Ano pang sagot mo? Timpani po, number 2. Anong, number 2 timpani, sige. Tingnan natin yung mamaya, ha? Yes, Alicia. Sir, so number one po is snare drum. Snare drum. Ayun, exactly. Tama na yung number one. Next, sino pa? Yes, Jaril Ann. Number five po, tambourine. Tambourine, number five. Yan, very good. Ano pa? Number four Luis? po, castanets. Castanets, okay. Some more. Nasagot na natin ang five, ang one, ang number two, ang number three, and number four. Tama ba? Nasagot na natin, ha? Okay. Have you tried playing these instruments? Which of them did you like playing? Okay, tingnan natin kung tama ang mga sinabi nyo. 
Okay, ayan. Okay, tama po ba ang sagot? Okay, snare drum, timpani, xylophone, kasanets, tambourines. Okay, those are examples of the instrument we are going to tackle for today's lesson. Okay, so take a look at the picture, children. So, anong nakita niyo sa picture po? What can you see in the picture? Sir, orchestra po. Yes, orchestra. So, have you already witnessed this kind of performance? Do you see yourself playing a musical instrument and be a member of this orchestra? Which do you prefer, singing or playing an instrument? And why? Okay. Who, who among you familiar with this in the picture? Oh, children. Diyan sa, sa picture, anong ginagawa ng mamang nasa gitna? Kumakanta ba siya? O nagpiplay? Nagpiplay? Nagkakanda. Eh, yung mga kaharap niya, yung ginagawa nila, kumakanta o nag, nag-play ng instrument? Po, tumutugtog. Tumutugtog. Ikaw, Jaril, anong pipiliin mo? Uh, singing or playing instrument? Singing po. Uh, pero kung may, kung pinapiplay ka ng instrument, gusto mo rin? Opo. O yung pinaka-best para sa'yo, alin doon? Singing. singing Why? Bakit singing ang gusto mo? Because Why I love singing and I'm happy. Okay, so doon ka nag-enjoy sa pagkakanta. Rather than mag-mimag, mag-pindot ng instrument. Okay, pwede rin naman. Okay. Okay, next. Yan. Okay, pakibasa po. Ah... Uh, Sino pwedeng magbasa? Sir. Go, Jarilan. The okay, word okay. orchestra refers to the area in front of the ancient Greek stage used by both performers and musicians. Today, it refers to a group of musicians playing different kinds of instruments. Orchestral instruments are categories based on the materials used and the way they are played and performed. While some instruments are bow or pluck, some instruments made of wood or silver are blown to mouth. Mouthpiece. Okay, very good. Thank you, Jarilan. So the word orchestra refers to the area in front of the, the ancient Greek stage. Kasi pinaka, sikat kasi nung unang panahon children sa panahon ng mga history, sila talaga yung pinakasikat yung Greek when it comes to orchestra. Wala tayong mga Pinoy dyan, wala tayo. Lately lang tayo na sumisikat pagdating sa sports, pagdating sa ito sa mga skills diyan lang tayo sumikat nit mga lately na po no so ayan uh, stage used by both performers and musician today it refers the group of musician playing different kinds of instruments so orchestral instrument are categorized based on the materials used in the way they played and perform while some instrument are bowed or black some instrument made of wood air or silver are blown to mouthpiece so so categorize so ibig sabihin may group din sa grupo nila na hati pa rin pala yan sila <coughs> excuse <coughs> excuse so sa <coughs> sorry children excuse lang Okay, so sa group of orchestra pala, hindi lang pala puro gitar yan, hindi, hindi lang pala puro instrument yan. Meron din palang mga 
ano yan sila, grupo-grupo. Merong wood, woodwind na tawag na woodwind, wood, meron din na tawag na string instrument. Okay? Yung woodwind naman, yun yung mga instrument na uh, binublo natin sa mga gita ng mouthpiece. Yung instrument na may mouthpiece. Okay? okay here are the samples of string instrument. Okay, can you identify those string instrument, children? Opo. Sige nga, ano-ano yung mga nandyan? Violin, viola, okay. cello, double bass, double bass pala, harp. Okay, very good. So, meron tayong violin. Viola, cello, double bass, double bass, uh, harp. Okay. Cello? Paano cello? Cello. Ha? Cello. Yes. Cello. Yes, still. Uh, okay, cello. So, okay. Very good. Thank you, Christine. Okay, that is cello. Okay, so the instrument in the Western Orchestra that are played by using a bow or by plucking the strings, they are other. They are often referred to as the backbone of the orchestra. Below are some of the instrument of the string family. So ayan na po ha, nakikita niyo na po sa inyong screen ang bawat string na meron tayo. Okay po? So, example here, violin is the in smallest instrument but the highest pitch in the string. So, pinakamaliit, the smallest one, but the high in pitch. Viola, the viola is a little bigger and tune a fifth lower than violin. Okay. And here comes the cello. It's the bigger than a viola but smaller than the double bass. Its strings are tuned in perfect fifth. Cello is played by bowing or by plucking the strings. It is held in between the knees while seated. Okay, the double bass or double bass is the biggest and the ba and has the lowest pitch in the string family. It is string may be plucked or bowed while the player is standing because of its large body. And then the last one is harp. Harp is made up of 47 string. It has a wide range of pitches and can produce both very low and high sounds. It is played by plucking the string. So, ayan children ha, medyo hirap pong mabasa kasi maliit dito sa screen. Okay, maliwanag po ba yun children? Apo. Okay, very good. What about the others? Maliwanag po ba? Christine? Yes, very good, Jenny. What about Christine? Maliwanag na po ba, Christine? Nawala na si Christine. Okay. Let's proceed. Okay, Christine, can you read this one? Hello? Sir. Okay. Go, go, Jarelan. Orchestra refers to the group of musicians playing different kinds of instruments. Go. Orchestral instruments are categories based on the materials used and how it, it is played. String instrument is played by using a bow or by plucking the strings. Members of the string family are violin, viola, cello, bass, and harp. 
Okay, very good. So, orchestra refers to the group of musicians playing different kinds of instruments. Orchestral instruments are categorized based on the materials used and how it is played. String instrument is played by using a bow or by plucking the strings. Members of the strings, string family are violin, violin, viola, cello, bass or bass, and harp. Very good. Any more questions, children, regarding the instrument? No. Hello. Magpo-proceed pa ba tayo, children? Mukhang wala na akong kausap dito. Yes po. Okay. Sige, buti na lang. Andyan pa rin kayong dalawa. Yung iba, di ko nakaalam kung nandyan pa, no? Sige. Let's proceed. Okay, yan po ang uh, Western Orchestra based on our string instrument. Okay po? Now, let's proceed to the next one. Okay, the art six. Uh, the art six, uh, we're, talk, we're going to talk about the steps and procedures in cell screen printing. Okay, so let us answer first the question. Okay. Sige, sige. Uh, can I call question number one? Sir. Go, Jaril Ann. Which of the following materials can be used in skill screen printing? Letter A silk. po. Oh, that's silk screen. Uh, Jaril, that is silk screen printing. Okay. The answer is letter A. Tingnan natin. Very good. Okay, number two. Jaline, can you read? Which state, Which states mean? Is not true about silk screen pin printing. Okay, what is your answer? Letter C. Let natin kung tama kayo ha. Okay, letter C. Silk screen printing is different with screen printing. Okay, number three. Nasana si Zinetti. Sinerchi, nandiyan ka pa ba? Tama ba si Sinerchi? Si Sinerchi yung si Kabilaw ba to? Sir. Si Sinerchi ba si Kabilaw ba to? Hindi po. Sir, magkaiba po ito lang. Si Sinerchi ah, po ito lang. Tapos si Kabilaw po babae. Ah, okay. Sino, sino yung tinutukoy ko kanina ang kabila? Sino yung sumagot kanina? Stel. Si Aiden po. Si... Pinagsabi po ano? what, ah? what share low daw. Ah, anong pangalan nun siya? Si, kabila po ako ng kabila siya ba yan? Opo, Hayden Crystal ah, Kabilaw po. Ah, tama, tama. Kala ko mali ang na-mention ko. Okay. So, yes, uh, tawagin natin si Clarice. Yes, Clarice, number three. Can you read? Where do we print the design that is going to be used in the screen printing? Po, okay, letter A. Sige, tingnan natin. Letter A or B, B, sabi niya? Okay, yeah. tingnan natin kung tama. Ah, the answer is letter D, transparency. Okay, next, number four. Okay, number four. Sir. Go, Jaril Ann. What is used to dry ink on... T-shirt in the process of silk screen printing. Letter B po. Blow dryer. Letter D. Very good. Letter B. Blow dryer. Okay. Number five. 
Sige nga. I would like to... Ako na. Sige, number five. Silk screen printing is the same with screen, screen printing. Okay, what would be your answer here? B po, sir. False. B, tingnan natin. Okay, the answer is letter A. Okay? So, let's proceed to the next one. Okay. Can you tell, remember, uh, can you still remember the activities in your art time when you were in your previous grades? Big sabihin, nung, when you were in grade 5. Okay, identify the elements and principle of design present in the pictures. Okay, nakikita po ba ang, ang, ang screen ko, children? Opo. What are the similarities of the artwork shown in the left side? Can you identify the method used? Children? Yes. Or, or which one is traditional or digital? Sige nga. Who can explain? Anybody would like to, to explain? Okay. So, because of that, our lesson for today is, ayan, look, look at the picture. Next picture, children. Ayan. Kita nyo po ba? What can you see about the picture in the left side? Hello. It's iron on on transfer. The design is transferred to the T-shirt. Okay, very good. Okay, what are the elements and principles of art present on the T-shirt's design? Ano mga elements ang nakikita niyo po? Meron ba siyang ano ba yung elements natin? Uh, line, shape, ano pa ba yon? Color, ano pa? Texture po. Yan, texture. Do you have an idea on how it is done? May alam ba kayo kung paano ito ginawa, nagawa? Self-screen printing po. Sir. Okay, very good. May idea siya, self-screen printing daw. What method of printing used to design the t-shirt? Anong method yung ginamit niya? Okay, so tingnan po natin sa next. Ayan. Uh, yes, uh, tayo. Nagkatala po kami module 3. Wala pa kayong module 3? Wala pa po, sir. Oh, sige, just focus na lang sa screen ko, children. Eh, uh, yung walang module, children, focus na lang po muna sa, sa screen ko, ha? Tapos... Anyway, pwede ka naman, meron pa naman, na, na, nababrowse nyo ba yung link na binigay dati? May link ba kayong nabubuksan? Kung wala, pwede naman kayong late na rin kayong manghingi sa school, ha? Pagka, pagka pwede nang manghingi doon, okay? Uh, for the meantime, may, ito, may, Ano na lang, basta mamaya sasagutan na lang natin yung ano. Yung wala, yung pwede nyo picture na lang din yung, yung wala mamaya sa screen ko po, ha? Okay po? Okay? Okay, who'd like to read? Can you read the, the, the meaning of printmaking, Tayos? Sir. Tayos. Okay, go, Jarel. And... Printmaking. Printmaking is, is one of the oldest art forms where an image is transferred from one surface to another. There are various methods of, of printmaking. Whatever material or method is used in printmaking, the purpose is to make an artwork that can be reproduced Repro reproduce many reproduce. times. What one of the one of this is silk screen printing. Very good. Okay. So again, printmaking is one of the oldest art form where 
An image is transferred from one surface to another. There are various methods of printing. So, whatever materials or method is used, meron po akong module 3, pero wala akong module 4. Okay lang. Uh, mal, uh, eh, pwede nyo na kayo mo bumisit, bumisita sa school. Siguro mamaya kung may nag-release. Nag, nag pero, you can chat, ma'am, saura na lang din para di kayo, hindi masayang yung pagpunta sa school, ha? English teacher nyo naman yun, di ba? Okay, so, ayan, be, reprodu, uh, it, uh, make an artwork that can be reproduced many times. One of this is the screen printing. So, what is screen printing? It is printing techniques. So, yun kanina yung tanong ko, anong, anong method or technique, so, Printing technique that make use of a woven mesh uh, to support an ink blocking. Stencil to acquire a desired image. The process involves using stencil to apply ink onto another materials, usually fabric like t-shirt, pouches, caps, or any materials that can keep the image into its surface. Okay, look at the picture or let again, uh, children. What do you need in self printing? Self screen printing. Ayan. So you have here the sample. We have design painted on transparency. We have mesh screen. We have liquid emulsion, squeegee, fabric paint. Okay, yan po ang mga kailangan natin. Okay, sino ang nakapunta na sa isang printing at nakakita nitong mga, mga ito? Sir. Sir. Yan, very good. So, familiar na pala si Jelaine regarding this, this, ano, this uh, materials needed in, in self-screen uh, self printing. Meron ba kayong pagawaan niyan, uh, Jelaine? Wala po, sir, pero tuwing mahal na araw po, nakikita ko lang po yung mga tao na gumagawa po ng ganyan sa t-shirt. Very good. O tama, t-shirt nga yan. Okay, so because of that, we have here the one to six procedures on how to make a self-screen printing. First, prepare design and print on transparency. Next, prepare the mesh screen, cover it with light sensitive emulsion. To three, position the printed film over the screen and expose it to a very bright light source. Number four, rinse off the excess emulsion. Once you have all the screens posed and cleans, you are ready to print. Number five, please place screen over t-shirt. Apply ink, any color of your choice using squeegee. So, yan ang gamit ni squeegee. Kung paka, pa, ano pala yun ang ink, di ba? And then, number six, using blow dryer. Dry ink on t-shirt. You now have a finished product. Okay, tingnan natin, ha? Okay, ito po yung sinagsasabi kong one to six. Malinaw po ba, children, ang screen core? Hello? Malinaw po ba? Opo. Okay, ayan po ang number one, number two, number three, number four, number five, and number six. Yan na po ang result sa number six. Okay? Okay, children, if you want to view the the the, the video regarding on this, you can click this, you, ano, yung link na sa baba po, ha? Pakipicturan nyo na lang po. Malinaw po ba, children? Okay, you can view that at the YouTube. Nakalagay o youtube.com, watch, mxn, jpgt, yan. Okay, next, proceed tayo. So, ayan, pakibasa po. Lahat tayo kung sino pwedeng magbasa. Ready? Six screen printing can be done on cloth or paper. It is a process that is often used for commercial purposes. Silk screen Purposes. printing. 
demonstrate the wonders of textile paint on cloth to make a print. Very good. Okay. Cell screen, cell screen printing can be done on cloth or paper. It is a process that is often used for commercial purposes. Self screen, self screen printing demonstrate the wonders of textile paint and cloth or on cloth or on cloth to make a print. Print, okay? So, maliwanag po ba children? Apo. Hello. Okay, very good. Tingnan natin kung talaga bang maliwanag sa inyo ha. Okay. Ayan, assessment na tayo. Okay, children, pakikuha ang inyong module, pakisagutan, o di kaya kung walang module, papel a eh, notebook, answer the question 1 to 5 for music and art. Nakikita po ba? Opo. Okay. Okay, I'll wait for you for 2 minutes. Kaya po, 2 to 3. And I'll send you the key answer. Okay, nakasabay po ba tayong lahat? Tayos, oh, nakasabay po ba? Yes, true, sir. Okay, very good. What about Sir Charles? Kalin, nakasabay po ba? Pakisagot po ako. Ivy? Nakasabay po ba si Ivy? Liam James, Azen, Zinichi, Rafael, Clarice, nakasabay po ba? Sige, antayin ko na lang po ang yung... Oh, sige, very good. Okay, antayin ko po. Just uh, pindutin niyo lang po ang raise hands kung tapos na para may, may check na natin agad. At nang makapagpahinga na rin tayo sa asynchronous. Sinun tapos na. Ayan, very good si Jelaine. Tapos na kagad si Jelaine. No? Next, sino pa kaya? Kunti-kunti ha. Bakit bilisan kunti children para di tayo ma malampas sa oras? Ayan, tapos na rin si Jaril Ann. Very good. Si Clarice, tama. Very good, tapos na rin. Ayan, very good. Si Aizen, tapos na rin. Pag-type na lang po sa, sa, ano, sa chat box lang po ha. Okay, done na rin si Thais. Okay? Okay, children, let us uh, check your work. Tina natin, i-chat niyo sa chat box later kung ilan ang score niyo ha. Okay, ready na po ba? I-prepresent ko na po ba yung answer? Opo. Sige. The answer po, ito po. Oh. Okay, ready? Okay, ano ako kung, hindi, kung may nagsasagot pa ha? So, so far, mukhang tapos na no? Okay, the answer is, the answers are ready, go. Ayan, pakicheck po. Okay, type sa chat box and score. Kung 5-5 five, five kayo. Ayan. 
Ayan, very good si Tayos. 5-5 siya. about the others? Ayan, <coughs> very good si Jelin. 4-4. Four, four. Sinechi, 4-3. Four, Okay, uh, Maria Luisa, 4-5, four, five, four, five. Cristo, 5-4, five, Adeline, 5-5, five, five. Rafael, 2-5, Clarice, 4-5, one mig 5-4, Clarice pala, 5-4 din. Hintay natin yung iba, mukhang nag-check pa lang. Okay. So, ayan. Very good. Si Azen, 4-5. Si Jaril Ann, 5-5. Very good. Okay. So, maraming salamat, children, at may natutunan kayo. Um, ayun pa, si Renz, 4. Bakit 4 lang, Renz? Alin dyan ang 4 mo? Okay. So, let's proceed, children. Okay, ayan, pakibasa po. 4 as in close, please answer what I can do on music and arts. Module 3. Okay, module 3. Ito po yun, children, ha? Pakipicturean na lang po kung wala kayong module. So lang, mukhang hindi malinaw sa inyo yung ano. Okay, nakikita po ba? Sir? Yes? Gagawin pa po ba yung sa activity to, yung t-shirt design contest? Saan? Dito sa module 3? Opo. Um... Kung kaya nyong gawin, gawin lang. Kung di nyo na kaya, oh, i-chat nyo lang ako, ha? Pagka, kung meron kayong gamit, pwede naman. Okay po, children. Pero kung wala talaga kayong gamit, huwag nang, huwag, huwag nang pahirapan ang sarili. Kung ano lang available natin. Yes? Silk screen po ba yung gagawin? Saan, saan? Sa... Yan po ba yung sa... Wait lang, wait lang. Natin. Ito ba yan? Ito, ito, ito yun? Opo. Okay. Um, children, kung may gamit kayo, pwede kayong gumawa at isend sa akin para makita ko naman. Pero kung wala talaga kayong gamit, um, pwede na rin wala. Huwag na natin pera pa ng ating sarili. Ha? Okay po? Okay po. Opo. Okay. Kung may available kayong gamit, okay lang. Kung wala talaga, okay? Hindi, quite ano na, hindi ko naman nahanapin na yan, ha? Okay po? Pero children, ito pa pala. Last week, di ba natapos natin ang module 2? So, hindi ako nagbigay ng long quiz sa inyo sa loob ng Holy Week. Kasi Holy Week nga, di ba? So, pwedeng... Uh, instead of itong ano na to, mod itong ano na to, mag-send ako mamaya ng long quiz. Okay lang ba sa inyo? Okay lang po so. Okay, kasi kung hindi nyo ito magagawa, pwede naman ito hindi nyo gawin ito kung wala talaga kayong gamit. Ito kasi kailangan dito may gamit talaga. Eh, no? Okay, kung wala, mamaya itisend ko sa inyo ang link ng long quiz. Okay lang po ba yun? Okay lang po so. Okay, very good. So, okay, next tayo. Proceed tayo ha. O oh, ayan, pakibasa po ng lahat. Good luck and then enjoy your asin asynchronous time, children. Have a nice day. Okay, have a nice day, children. Antayin nyo na lang mamaya yung link ka sa long face. Okay lang po ba yan? Apa, apa. Okay, bye-bye. Ingat, children. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.
<laughs> yes, Alan, Alan, ya. We have question. Bye, okay. bye, bye. Okay. Sino to si Ano tong Chinese? Di ko alam yan, Payos. Ano yung Chinese na yan? <coughs> okay, goodbye, children. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Liam James, Daphne, bye bye. Daphne, Liam, bye bye. Out na Jaril Ann. 